It was a lot of fun. They worked hard. We had nine finalists. Uh, we had we broke the team record for points and six champions. It was a very productive uh, weekend. We were trying to break the, the champion record, most champions, and the school record, and we ended up just breaking the school record, but we didn't expect to do it because after fi semifinals, we didn't have enough points, we didn't think, but we actually beat it, so I'm pretty happy about that. It's really special, you know, uh, not a lot of freshmen get to win this tournament and just knowing that I did something a lot of people couldn't, it's just a lot of confidence. It actually came by a lot faster than I expected because I just felt like last year I was in sixth grade just watching Nico and Paul Fox and Willie win their CCS title and now I'm here and now I have to step up. They are further along than most freshmen are at this point in, in their career. However, they still need a lot of mentoring and a lot of uh, TLC, and we're more than willing to provide that for them. We'll have a really young team, but I think we'll be dominating because we just have so much talent on the Gilroy team, and as we um, progress and get older, we'll, this won't, we can't be stopped. Uh, it feels good. I fell, sh fell short last year. It just feels good that I put in all that hard work, and now it actually pays off. You know, everyone doubted us, you know, even like ex-wrestlers, you know, everyone doubted us, thought, you know, we weren't going to do it without all our big studs from last year. But, you know, we came in, young team, missing a couple of ways, and we still did it. You know, so it, it, it's, a great, it's a great feeling. We actually wanted to break uh, both records, uh, uh, individual champs and uh, points, but, you know, some things happen and... Yeah, you know, but we still got we still got the point, so that's all that's all good. We always strive to be the best and try to beat beat our past records and everything. So we have a good coaching team, like our our coach, Greg Brella, always tells us to be our best, strive for what we want, strive for the best. Being a senior is awesome. Yeah, it's great, man. You know, last year we set a CCS record for the uh, most points scored as a team, and then again we came back next year and broke it. it feels great. If you would have told me before the season started that we were going to break the record with after. Nico and Paul and Victor and Lupe and all those great seniors left. I, I would I'd say I don't think so, but I'm excited for them. You know, they deserve it. They work hard for this opportunity. Breaking the record was amazing last year, and it feels even better this year. New team, all these freshmen, and we still managed to do it. This team's gonna be stronger when we leave. They're gonna break it again.
Thank you. Lord, I want to thank you for another good day. Uh, thank you for a good week. Help keep these guys healthy and uh, give them a nice good workout in. I ask you, Lord, to watch over them these next couple of days and help them uh, manage their time correctly. School work, rest, recovery, all that stuff matters right now. Lord, I ask you to come here and, and help them just relax their minds and get good night's sleep and uh, be ready to go tomorrow and the next day and uh, take care of these next five or you know, five, six days. <coughs> Uh, I want to thank you for these opportunities with these guys, wrestling with these guys, knowing these guys their whole lives, and uh, being a part of it, letting them be, <coughs> be a part of my life, and let, uh, letting me be a part of their life, and uh, going through this whole experience together. It's been, it's been a blessing to know these things. Amen. Amen. Take down on three. One, two, three. Take down. my game I saw he was prepared for me so I took it to him most to your team's success? Uh, the quality of the kids. Uh, their, their heart, their dedication to the sport, their love for each other. Uh, that, that's the only reason why we won this tournament. We had so many guys sacrificing uh, you know, themselves, giving up weight classes, going up. Uh, we had two guys going up 20 pounds, giving up 20 pounds. It's stuff like that, you know, that, that, um, that contributed to our, our records, the kids, the quality of the kids. I want to make our program look so good. You know, this year, they, I had the choice of going more 60s or cutting down, and you know, I was like, well, if that's what he thought was best, that's what I did. You know, it was, it was a lot of weight, you know, 20 pounds. I really never cut weight. But I was like, if that's what he thinks is best for the program, then I'll do it, you know. And it turns out we needed that because, you know, in order to break those those 10 point records, I had to make that weight and wrestle that weight and win. And so it's really damn that and like everything that keeps me going.
going with Paul Fox, 152 pound champion. Paul, take me through that matchup. Uh, I've wrestled him a few times before, and this time I felt like I was wrestling really well and I came out on, on top. You guys put on such an impressive performance in day one, essentially locking up the entire night already early. But was the record on your guys' mind? Absolutely. Um, we went in on a mission. We wanted to, we wanted to break the record. Uh, it's one of the goals we set as a team early on in the year to you know win a state title. Uh, and we've won CCS titles before. We have not broke the record in a long time, and we wanted to break it. And so that was one of our goals from the beginning. We just broke the CCS record for po total points scored. Was that that? Three to five, three to five finals wins, and now we're fifth one. So congratulations, Gilroy. Congratulations to your uh, CCS title. What do you think has been the biggest obstacle today for you to overcome and become a champion? Uh, probably my biggest obstacle is just opening up my offense a little bit more and uh, just getting over that. It's my last time wrestling in the Bay Area, you know, it's just, it's just a sad feeling, but uh, you know, it's, that's probably my biggest obstacle right now. Awesome, super excited. Oh yeah, I totally miss it, but just to see these guys go out there and have fun and uh, do it for the team, it's just great to see. And it's, exciting to see them all contribute and get that record. For him to be able to, to come back here to go over after three years and get denied a Russell and still stay in the room shows a lot about him. I mean, that shows commitment to the sport, to the team, that, I mean, he cared about us. He didn't just go, okay, I can't wrestle. I'm not going to be here anymore. I'm going to do something else my time. He stayed. It's, it was sad that he couldn't wrestle, but it was still, I mean, he got to focus on helping push us to be to be better. It was great.